Hmm. Shadow divination. Void essence. Uh, You'll get those. Soon. Sure. <laughs> I'll do my best <laughs> getting that. Void essence. Uh, right after I buy the potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> like, really, dude? <laughs> sure. I'll get you your void essence. Today, Precarious plays Stardew Valley. Milk in the cows. Milk in the sheep. Oh, it doesn't work. Actually. So you really. You beat A Link Between Worlds without getting a single nice item. I mean, I guess. I they don't were even all know blue. what you're talking about. They... So, this is super weird to me because it feels like you managed to squeak through the game. And I'll, I will say, they are not essential, right? Clearly, they're not. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. Because you didn't... You beat the game. I just didn't, like, every time I died, I just got so mad that I shut it off anyway, so it didn't even... You didn't even have to, like, rent them more than once? Right. I never even rented them more than once. It was like, as soon as they would become available, I would go rent them, and it wouldn't cost me anything because it was, because I was, I would rage quit. <laughs> <laughs> well, Get my is... monies back, I guess. I completely understand that. I think that if it... If the economy in that game had like a failing, it was probably that it didn't auto save to prevent that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But I understand that you know they probably probably wanted to be a little more gentle than that. Well, I mean, honestly, if you have the patience to put up with that sort of nonsense of just quitting without saving and and all of that, then maybe you should be allowed to have whatever you feel like. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. It does. It, it Having does. to possibly repeat content is definitely its own punishment. It's, it, yeah, it's its own tax. And whether you decide you want to deal with that or not is up to you. Yeah, now I would say that ultimately in that game, it could possibly be damaging just because by not... Run at them, run at them, no, run at them. No, they're so... No, sorry, sorry. Oh. <laughs> I, just... I like how that last one jumped at you and was like, I'll get you! Oh, I'm uh, away. Sorry, buddy. Immediately changed my mind. They're so beautiful. So I think that you might have skipped two important elements of the game. Because mm. did you did you collect the... Uh, the was it Miamis or Miamis? Oh, mm, the, the, the world's most annoying Wait. object. <laughs> Is that what they were? Yes, I hated them by the end of the game. I, like, it start, don't get me wrong, they started out like, oh, poor babies, I'm on a quest for 101 Dalmatians. And then by the end, I was just like, oh my god. Because anytime I was in a place where I was like, no, I'll just come back for this dude later, there wasn't like a snooze button. Or anything of the sort. So they would just keep whining. <laughs> but yeah, I did skip those. Well, not entirely. I tried to collect the a big bunch one. of them. Break the big one. This big one? That's the big one. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Flash. Whoa. 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 And, and uh, back to my work. First 30 or 40 floors are now trivialized. <laughs> Perfect. Mm-hmm. And I, I, I mean that for real. So, how many of them do you think you collected? Do you, do you recall? Uh, quite a few, but I don't recall the actual number because things like that don't stick to me very well, like stats. But that, that probably means that you didn't actually use them for anything. I don't know. I might have. I think I collected enough to get something but like i said it's kind of foggy that type of stuff doesn't stick to me what sticks to me is like story like plot points and stuff like that i don't know man i'm i think that that the time that you helped like a weird octo mama recover all of her babies and she imbued your items with great power you mean the that, time that i failed at babysitting for this octo mama that who had already lost all of her children that's a pretty compelling compelling it's, narrative that's a cute a little story what it's green down here i just wanted you to know that this is the first time i've seen this yeah you gotta kill the monsters it's look at the blurps on the wall and those have eyes 
Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, all right. I have a better. Oh, Just keep an eye on your oh, HP. Gosh. Gosh, Dergs. You know what? I'm just going to eat something right now. And I need to clean this crap up. Let's Why see. do you only have one mushroom? I thought you had five. Well, I put some away because I assumed I would get some more this morning, but... Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I might go up a couple <clears throat> levels and... The purpose... The mechanical purpose of those guys is important because what it does is it encourages you to solve little mini puzzles in the mm -hmm. environment and explore the world very thoroughly. And most importantly, it encourages you to explore old areas again with new items that you acquire. Mm -hmm. I did like that. And in exchange, worse, in exchange, the way that the item, like each item has three stages in A Link Between Worlds. The rented item, which has the doofy little, like I think it's worth buying the items in that game just so that we get to pluck the dumb little hat off of Oh, it's so there. cute. What are you talking about? I want purple ears on everything I have. Wow, you just killed them while they were banging. Yeah, well, we can't let really them gross. reproduce, can we? Ugh, I this mean, they're place gonna, is... They're gonna do it once you leave anyway. Where do you think, how do you think that these dungeons are repopulated? I thought this was a farming simulator. This is just slaughter fest. Okay. Only for Carrots! The only for the month of winter and only some of the time. Okay. Once your foraging improves, you should switch to your sword. Uh, but that's a fucking carrot. There we go. Once your foraging improves, you'll be able to farm your way through the winter if you want. Or if you have more animals. Mm -hmm. And you can just talk to the townspeople. Anyway, the point is that after you've purchased an item, you're supposed to go back, I think it's every 10. Uh, Miami, M M Mamie, Miami. It's mother. My, M okay, whatever. So every ten octa babies, you go back to her, and she swallows one of your items, and then she shoots it back out, and it's nice, and it's more blue usually for maybe some reason. I, I don't know. Blue maybe is I, the the color of nice items. Maybe I did buy some of. What is that? Is that a present for me? I think it's usually, I think bags in the mines are normally filled with um, coal. That's fine. I'll take that. Well, yeah, I mean, it, it sounds, I realize now that it's got that connotation of like, oh, coal in the stocking, but it's actually really good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Six. Six I just coal. won. You see that? Me winning? So, yeah, maybe I did buy some of the items, but I certainly don't remember it being a necessity. If I did, it was at your, you know, advice. Instance. Yeah, like, oh my god, they all still have ears on them. What's up with that? <laughs> well, let me tell you some of the effects, and then maybe it will... Maybe it will remind you. Whenever you fired your bow, did it shoot three arrows in a sort of a, a W pattern? Like they would shoot at one would go straight ahead and then two would go out in a V on either side. I don't think so. Uh, could your hook shot stun and damage people? Um, don't remember. Okay, so this is going nowhere at the speed of light. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so to answer your question I don't remember and didn't care to actually pay for any of them if I ever did it was because you said I should it doesn't sound important anymore I just thought it was interesting presents I just thought it was interesting because I was going to use a Link Between Worlds is an example of how they have improved the economy mm -hmm. in Zelda games. And then I immediately like slapped you in the face with that little fact where I was like, I never even bought anything in that one. That one sucked. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Wait, no, I just, I want mm -hmm. you to clarify. You actually, you really liked the playing of that one, Oh, right? I loved that game. Yeah. yeah. I played 
I, I played it very uh, quickly and efficiently and happily, which doesn't always happen with me. Sometimes I'll get through like a third of a game and then I just stop. And uh, not for usually any good reason other than being distracted and then not being able to play for, for too long for me to pick it back up. You should clean your inventory a bit. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh man, I think I have enough jellies for the jelly people. <laughs> Jellies for the jelly man. Jellies for the jelly man. Jelly man, jelly man. I also have an Omni Geo. Whoa. You get in my belly, you can. I should maybe go to the blacksmith. I think tomorrow we might have to go to town. I've got a lot of stuff. Goodness, I got stuff for Gunther. At least, like, what? Three or four? I think one, two. Assuming yeah, that and all then of those are new. The geodes are next door to him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we gotta take care of that. Ooh. Oh, so much mess. <laughs> and you can sell the geodes that are, or not the geodes, the artifacts and minerals that are duplicates and that will give you a nice little booster shot. Mm -hmm. Can you make a recycling uh, machine? The recycling machine yet? Uh, I think so, oh, there it is. but I need an iron bar and I haven't All gone far right. enough. That's why I've been like crazy going in. Well, one of many reasons because I don't have iron yet and so many things, so many cool things have iron in them like this one, which doesn't have any iron. Uh, this, nope, uh, that, oh, come on. Just sprinklers, <laughs> where is the bat wing, see? Lightning rod, that's an important that's one. That's an important one, yeah. yes. Point made. Kind of. I think that it's interesting how it took you a really long time to get over the first major hurdle mm -hmm. in the mines, mm -hmm. which is getting down far enough to get that first like pretty good sword. Oh, because it feels weird buying like even just buying like the wooden sword from the adventuring shop. Mm -hmm. It feels weird. What? I need. It's to the end of the episode. That's gross, don't... Yeah. Ew. Thanks, game. No, no thanks. I might sell a chub, but I'm not gonna eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Next time, Vicarious plays around with the idea of selling its chub. Ew. Fail. Just, just do what do you will, but yeah. no chubs. 